Okay. Hello friends, welcome to my channel. Today I am here to discuss about two face serums from the company called The Ordinary. Before that, if you are new to my channel, do not forget to subscribe and hit the bell icon in case you need further notification on such videos. And by end of this video, if you think it's informative enough, please like and share as well. So let's quickly start discussing these two products which I have for you today. The first one is known as The Ordinary Resveratrol 3% plus Ferulic Acid 3%. This is how the packaging looks like. This is basically a glass bottle uh, with a dropper like this. Yep. Uh, this particular bottle would weigh around 30 ml and would cost around a range of INR 950 to INR 1200 depending upon from where you are buying and what sort of discounts are going on. But that's the basic uh, range of this particular product. Uh, this product is uh, made for all skin types but I would still uh, recommend everybody to do a patch test whenever you are trying any sort of new uh, products for your skin. Please do a pa patch test for this one as well. This is made for all skin types anyways. Uh, this is basically an anhydrous serum. Anhydrous serum means this doesn't contain any sort of water content, doesn't have any water content into it. This is made for people who want something for uh, in concern to aging of their skin. So basically it's going to help you with uh, prevention of oxidative stress. In, in other words, if I say it, it would prevent you from free radicals and would prevent the damaging of skin, which eventually is going to help you with aging of your skin. This is also would be helping you with brightening and smoothing of your skin. This is what the company claims. Uh, this has a shelf life of six months so you need to complete this uh, within six months once you start once you open up the lid so coming to my experience with this particular product i bought this product uh, just to give it a try because uh, i strongly believe once you cross your 30 35 you know you need to start taking care of your skin in terms of aging because i know some people would say it's pretty early but yeah prevention you know you need to stamp it early so that's how i try to go with products which could help or which could you know prevent aging of the skin in a much earlier stages so this is how i end up uh, buying this particular serum uh let me tell you let me show you how is it it's basically a yellow in color and the worst part that it's very very oily so if i can show you this is how it is and the texture is really really oily i don't know if you can see it yeah seems like i have just dropped a uh, dropped a little bit of oil on my skin so and because it's so oily it takes a lot of time to get absorbed so it's very irritating for me to you know apply this and stay a whole night with this particular product um so that is one of the reason i don't like this one and secondly it actually didn't help me with anything because uh, there was no difference between before and after use of it. I have used almost more than half of the bottle which took me almost two months to finish it off. After that I just stopped it because you know it, it wasn't giving me any sort of result and neither I was liking this in, in terms of texture or anything. So it's a no for me I, I won't be buying this in fact i'm not going to use the rest of the half of the bottle also the second product which i have for you today is the ordinary retinol one person in squalene again the packaging looks exactly the same i mean this one is weighing around 30 ml and would cost around INR 2000 that's an approximation of the cost uh, this product is also made for all skin types and is a anhydro serum similar sort of a serum this is again is made for uh, taking care of aging of the skin but however i have uh, gone through many videos and many reviews that retinol is very good for you know uh, if you are having scars or dark spots on your skin or uneven skin tone pigmentation etc etc retinol does helps but the company says this particular product is only is gonna help you with aging of your skin but I still give it a try because, you know, I have a little bit of dark spot here and there because of pimples. And uh, I really want something to help me out with that. So The Ordinary is a good brand and, uh, and there were a lot of suggestions about retinol. So I went with this one. So 
uh, the ordinary has a lot of percentage they started from 0.02 percentage of retinol and then 0.5 and then 1 and then 2 they have a uh, step by step uh, you know products for the people to use it so if you are starting with retinol you should go with 0.2 and then gradually once your skin gets adapted to retinol because retinol is something which is gonna sensitize your skin it's a very very strong content so you know you need to take care and you need to be you know cautious whether your skin is accepting that product or not so you need to start with 0.2 once your skin gets adapted only then you go to 0.5 and further on so yeah that's how i started using it and i i have used until one percent uh, of retinol with ordinary squalene is a moisturizing agent squalene is squalene is generally a natural uh, moisturizing agent which is already there in our skin uh, the company has used the same formula to add on with retinol as i said retinol is a very very strong ingredient and you know something needs to be added to it to get it balanced with your skin so squalene is something they have added with this particular product uh, this is gonna help you again the company says this is gonna help you only with the signs of aging and it's gonna help you with uneven skin tone as well uh, but during after during the, the usage of this particular product you need to be very very cautious because your skin is gonna be gonna be very very sensitive to uv rays as well as to some other you know products which you're gonna use you need to be cautious on that you need to take care on that uh, pregnant women are not allowed to use any sort of product which contains retinol so do take a note of it in case you need it coming back to my experience with this particular product again i have finished almost the whole bottle and let me show you how it looks like this is basically a again the same sort of but i guess i guess this is a bit oxidized now the company says you need to keep it in freezer refrigerator in case you want to use it on a regular basis so i guess it's been oxidized now otherwise it, it has a clear uh, color and again this one is also a bit oily in texture but lesser than as compared to uh, the other one which i showed you so as per texture it is okay but uh, in, in in sense of uh, results for the reason why why i bought this it didn't give me any 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 effect or any sort of results in in, in terms of uh, my dark spots or scars it didn't reduce at all this bottle took me almost three months to get over it and but still in three months i didn't see any any difference in my dark spots or you know the sort of pigmentation i had nothing nothing it did nothing basically so these two are the products which i'm not gonna consider buying again because it didn't help me at all in terms of what they were supposed to uh I would not comment much about the aging part because you know I don't have that much of science yet but again it didn't improve anything uh, but I didn't, didn't smoothen my skin like anything so it's still the same and uh, retinol one uh, is absolute uh, disappointment for me because it didn't help anything about uh, it didn't do anything about my uh, dark spots so but still, in case you want to give it a try, you can go ahead with it because I strongly believe that every skin type is different and you know every, every product would react differently to those skin types. But there is a generalization how the company makes it. So this is how we share our uh, experiences with you guys. In case you think your skin is similar to mine, probably this would react the same way it did to me. So guys, uh, in case you are trying this, let me know how it worked for you and till my next video, stay tuned. Have a very, very good day. Bye-bye.